we decided to head up north to attend Overland Expo. First on our to-do list was to find a campsite to call home for the night. What do you call these hot dogs? They, are they, no, are they big? Are they bigger than a blanket? <laughs> you call them? Bigger than a blanket or a pancake? <laughs> Remember when you called Ted? Don't piss off and ask him if they had a whole Nori hot dog. They said no. Oh, yeah. With our bellies full, we braced ourselves for the cold night ahead. Hey Matt. Hey. <laughs> so what are we doing here today? Where are we going? Uh, right now we're at Circle K. But where we're going is the Overland Expo. 2019. 2019. That's true. Yeah. Flagstaff, Arizona. So what do you hope to achieve at this Overland Expo? Uh, probably get talked into buying a lift for my foreigner. Hopefully. Very nice. Very hopeful. Maybe buy some shit. I don't know. It's gonna be it's gonna be hella cool there. Last, last year was really cool. Um, it was a little hotter last year. It's kind of cold this, this year. We're getting some good weather this, this year. I don't, this year around. Good, I don't know if you call it good weather. I'm not really fond of cold. But it was, it's a really nice day today. So. Well, it's better than heat stroking in Arizona, that's for sure. <laughs> we get to see all this, I mean, and, and uh, down this in green. Phoenix. All this green instead of just all brown. <laughs> all right. What about you, Dorian? It's my first time going. Definitely excited. I don't know if I'm gonna buy anything. Oh, you're gonna buy some shit. So, someone will probably persuade me into buying stuff. If it's not you guys, it's one of the we got, people there. We got three credit cards. <laughs> three. We're my, with we're high, interest. Credit cards. high interest. <laughs> high interest. <laughs> we're just gonna regroup here at uh, Circle K and uh, head over to Overland Expo. We kind of do things a little different this year. They're um, usually you could park at Overland Expo, but I guess it's gotten so big that. You have to either pay for parking or you have to park at NAU and then get shuttled there. So little, we, we, we were late. We were late to buy yeah, tickets. Yeah, we were a little late. So, you know, unfortunately we didn't get to uh, buy any parkings. It sold out before we could buy it. So we're going to go probably either find a parking nearby or we're going to go to NAU and park there and get shuttled over there. We'll, we'll see what we decide. Please listen carefully. Overland Expo offers many different experiences, from taking classes to checking out products from different vendors. And of course my favorite part of it all is checking out people's different builds. It's awesome to see people's personalities really show through their vehicles. Overland Expo makes for a great day. Although in my opinion, you really have to do all three days to take full advantage of what it has to offer. With some hunger built up, we decided to head into town and grab a bite to eat. We just got done eating some pizza. We're about to head home. Uh, what you guys think of the Overland Expo? I loved it. I'm definitely going to come back. You're good? Will you guys be coming back next year? For sure. Anything you guys would have done different? Change about it? I would change that I actually have a vehicle this time around, like last time. <laughs> I would change that not to buy because they didn't check anything. Yeah, <laughs> you just walked in. 
just walk in. Anybody just walk in to the expo. I'm pretty sure they like, checked the, the sure toy van. Like, like, okay. I had this covered up. No one saw that I had my thing on the whole time. We get a scan. Yeah, we get, so these are the bands we get for... We get a save for, we get a save for $45. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $40. $